If your company is using Microsoft Teams for your web conferencing and video calls, then this is a video you'll definitely want to check out. Of course, by now you're familiar with the background blur tools so you can add privacy on your video calls, but Microsoft has recently rolled out a new feature which lets you pick a background replacement. So instead of seeing a blur, you can now be transported into a really sleek office, or maybe you're even transported into another land. Now, don't get me wrong, we absolutely love this feature and think the pre-built backgrounds are great, but we also know people love to show off their personalities through adding their own customizations. You will notice there are no options in Teams to add a customized background. Now, I'm sure in the future updates, this will become a standard feature, but if you can't wait until then, we did a little research and found a way that lets you customize your background today. Now, this may not work for everyone since there are settings that could be controlled by your company's administrator or maybe there's a version of Windows that it doesn't work for, but if you're able to get to this directory in your file explorer, then it will most likely work for you. We will be putting this link in the description in case you want to copy and paste it yourself. And to get there, simply open File Explorer, which is usually pinned to the taskbar, copy and paste or manually type in the address, either drag and drop or copy and paste the image you will want to use. Teams will automatically readjust the dimensions of your photo to 16 by 9, so if your photo is smaller or larger than the specifications, your photo will be stretched or cropped to fit the screen. And that's it. That's all you have to do. If you want to test to make sure it works before your next video call, you can go to the calendar menu in Teams and click the Meet Now button in the top right. In your meeting preview window, make sure your camera is on and then turn background blur on as well. Once you do, a new menu blade will appear where you can select your background. And if you scroll to the very bottom, you will see your custom background. Click it once and Teams will make it your background on the next video call. I hope you all enjoy your new backgrounds, and if you are brand new to Teams and didn't understand a single thing I was talking about, please visit us at protectedtrust.com and select the Resource tab to access our free introductory course on Teams, Teams Essentials.